it's that time again for one of my favorite videos to film swatch and sip if you're new here pause right now go grab yourself a drink because we are going to drink our delicious drinks and swatch some beautiful makeup the whole point behind this series is just to enjoy makeup for what it is you don't always have to wear it you can enjoy the makeup by just playing with it and swatching it all over your body for my drink today i have my own little homemade pumpkin spice latte ish kind of thing mm. it's my second of the day so this one is decaf because i'm sensitive to caffeine the secret to this drink if you like pumpkin flavored things Go to Trader Joe's, they have an oat pumpkin drink. Oh my gosh, you use that in replacement of your milk though. There is kind of a lot of sugars in there. So I did half pumpkin drink, half my normal milk, but if you do it with all of the pumpkin drink, your coffee will be so pumpkin-y delicious, but I'm trying to be healthy, so we do half and half here. Cheers, baby. Anyways, <laughs> today we're gonna be swatching a new type of product that I'd never experienced prior using these multi chrome eyeliners I wanted to do a swatch and sip on this because we needed to see these in action and see how they differ from eyeshadows and just enjoy these for how beautiful that they are so today's video is very kindly sponsored by Bethlehem now this is not my first partnership with Bethlehem I've worked with them in the past and I of course agreed to work with them the first time because I love their products and so when they reached out about the newest product that they launched, I was like, heck yeah. The quality is amazing just as the eyeshadow palette was that I tried in the last video. I will link it down below if you want to check it out. And I was shocked mostly by the great quality that you got for the price point. And it's also on Amazon so you can get it delivered to you really quickly, especially if you got that Prime membership. So when they launched this new product, I was so excited. And then of course, I was even more excited by the quality that we have. And I can't wait to show you how to use multi-chrome eyeliners, how I got this look today with them. Let's go ahead and get into it. So the new product that they launched are called the Chameleon Eyeliners. I'm gonna tell you the price now because that's one of the best parts of Bethlehem if you ask me. So these eyeliners are going to be $15 and 80 cents but listen to this when you place an order you will get a 20% discount and then if you use the coupon code Morgan MUA 20 that will save you an additional 20% off so what 40% off right and you're able to get the eyeliners for nine dollars and fifty cent with those discounts under ten dollars for a multi chrome eyeliner that is a phenomenal price so whatever you order from the brand make sure you use my code and then you'll get a really great discount because Bethlehem really just delivers great quality makeup at like an insanely good price and so many of you guys in the last video I did with Bethlehem told me that you ordered the palette that I spoke about and you loved the quality so that's why I was even more confident and excited for today's video these are the new chameleon eyeliners they're gonna come in this pretty multi chrome packaging like so like I said, you're able to get these for under $10 and they are a high chrome multi shift pencil eyeliner. There are four shades in the line. We are gonna go ahead and swatch these babies. So I guess the first winner that we have is going to be Northern Light. And by the way, these are all vegan, cruelty free and fragrance free as well. Lights are down so we can see the beauty that is. Okay. So here is what the eyeliner packaging is going to look like. And then actually if you pull the bottom, there is a sharpener if you need, which is amazing. So this is what Northern Light looks like. And this is described as color shifts from dark blue to purples. So let's see the swatch. Are you ready? So it's very smooth. There's no tugging or anything on the skin that's happening. You can see they have a good pigment to them. Do you see that dark purple to blue shift? That is stunning. And you'll see me use these in an example in the second half of the video when we get to the tutorial. So you'll see it on, in action on the eyes. This is my favorite for just a simple winged liner. Let's go into the next one, which is Wild Oasis. I may or may not have Wild Oasis on my eyelid today, and it may or may not be my favorite. <laughs> now this has color shifts from green to dark blue. I have mine over a blue and green base today so that we could see all of the shifts on the eyes. Once again, super creamy. It's harder to swatch an eyeliner than it is eyeshadow. This one is Wild Oasis, which is on my eyelid. So yeah, this one is definitely my favorite of the four, I think. It is just 
<laughs> so pretty and you can see those shifts. This next one is called Metallic Glam, which shifts from pink to gold. So this one is up my alley because you know how I love kind of like my purpley pinky shades. This one would look absolutely amazing underneath a purple base. And then a golden topper over top. I can't believe that these are in an eyeliner form. I've never used eyeliners that were in multi-chrome before. There's one last shade, Siren Call. I really hope they come out with more because these are just too fun. This one is the most wearable for you neutral lovers. This is color shifts from bronze to gold. This is gonna look so stunning with a brown base to it. So again, here is Siren Call. And I do use this in the demos next as well. And don't these just look absolutely incredible? And I know it's crazy that these are gonna go on your eyes. But here is the best part that makes these, in my opinion, stand out from eyeshadows. They are completely budge-proof, smudge-proof, 24-hour wear. They are not going anywhere. If you have really oily eyelids, look at this. No smudging whatsoever. And this is gonna be a pain in the butt to take off. I share a story at the end about the first time that I swatched these, but these aren't coming off in the, in the shower or anything. Once they set down, these guys are not going, I'm pressing so hard on I'm doing the top because they've had the longest to set down. So you do have a little bit of wiggle room to blend if you want, but completely waterproof, smudge proof. It is quite incredible. It's as impressive as it looks, I'm telling you. So since this was a kind of shorter swatch session because we only have four shades, I'm gonna go into demos of how you can use these, some different ways that I would like to use these, and you'll be able to see these babies in action as well as how I got today's look. So let's go ahead and get into it. Before we get into the look you saw earlier, I just wanna give a few more examples of how you can use these eyeliners. So I'm gonna take one of the eyeliners and I'm gonna actually use it as eyeliner. <laughs> I just wanna show you how smooth it applies. So kind of a really basic way. I would say if you are not a big eye makeup wearer, but you know, you're going out for the evening, you want to do something fun, you can literally just use this as regular eyeliner and it's like a fun eyeliner with a twist. And you can see there's no tugging happening whatsoever on my eyes. Always when you're using a pencil liner, use your nail to sharpen. So if you are not big into eye makeup, you can literally just wear it like this put a little bit of sparkle on the eye, and then you can see the shift as well. It applies so high-end, so expensive. There's no tugging on the eyelid at all. I mean, even do a little, I know I don't have concealer on yet, but I'm gonna do my little inner corner wing. So that's kind of a more wearable example. You can also, I'm not the best with graphic liner. That's not my forte. <laughs> but you can actually carry it over to get a cool graphic liner look. Not my not my style. It's an option. And then also, there's one that's a little bit more wearable, the golden one. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to show you it applied as an eyeshadow because it really does apply so smooth. I'm just going to take my Spice palette from Bethlehem and apply this to my crease, keeping it pretty light and natural. This is if you want the eyeliner to kind of stick out by itself. And these last in the waterline as well, if you wanna use them in the waterline. And then I'm gonna take a little bit of the two matte greens. We're gonna mix them together. I'm going to apply this to the outer corner and blend it. I'm going to actually go into the darkest color. Just as a really light natural base. I'm just trying to keep it pretty wearable. I'm going to take the eyeliner and I'm literally just going to draw it all over the eyelid. And you guys know this is not my style of makeup typically, but I've seen a lot of people kind of do this shape. To make it more me, I'm going to go ahead and take a green shade and blend out the edges. I like more of a diffused look. And then once this sets down, it is going to set down. So if you are gonna be out at like a concert, somewhere really hot, an all day event, a festival, these are really great because they are not going to budge. Now this is one of the more wearable colors, but you still get that really neat shift. So those are just a couple examples of how I would wear these. Let's get a whole look together. This look is just, so 
good. Okay, let me show you how I did it. So for the base shades, I used some shadows from my Befalin Spice palette. You don't need to use eyeshadows with this look, but if you like a blended look, definitely use some base powder shadows. I actually did a whole video about this a couple months ago on this palette because I'm so shocked. It was in my favorites video as well because of how affordable it is and how good quality it is. And I've had so many of you guys message me how you tried this out and it, it's that girl, you know? And my discount code does also count on this palette. So if you use Morgan MUA 20, that will save you the additional 20% off. And then of course with the 20% off when you place the order, and it's a legitimate good quality palette. That is what is so insane about this and you'll see in the application So let's go ahead and get started So I'm gonna start off with the shade sparkle right here Which is a light blue and I'm just gonna use that as kind of a transition shade for the whole look Just applying only a little bit and it's gonna help the shadows blend a little easier But we're gonna be mixing a lot of green and blue shades. So just be prepared for that and you can see it builds up to be quite pigmented even though it's such a light pastel shape. I'm gonna continue to use this brush and, and I'm gonna go into the shade, oh this is sky, not sparkle, this is sparkle because there are sparkles in it. So I'm gonna go into sparkle and I'm going to apply this to the center of my crease like so. You can see they're pigmented, blending easily, making a great base shape. And then I'm going to go into this shade right here, which is the darker green. And I'm going to circle this in the outer corner, pigment, high. Then we're going to blend that. So this is bringing in the green element to the look. And I'm going to continue with that shade. I'm going to take a flat shader brush and I'm going to put this all over the lid because I want a green base for the eyeliner so that more of the green shows through. So if you want it to be more blue, applying a blue base will work great. And if you want it more green, applying a green base is going to be great. And then I'm going to take a small brush and I'm going into Moon Night right here. Even though this is a shimmery shade, it's going to work great in the outer corner. Because it is a shimmer, the best technique to use is to press it down first and then blend it out. And I'm kind of creating a mini wing here. And then go back in with the green and blend the green to help blend it out. Then make sure you blend the edges. I got a little bit more of that sky shade that's going to kind of make everything have a softer blend. This eye always looks better because <laughs> I know what I'm doing better. Okay, so this is the base. It doesn't even need to be perfect gonna take your eyeliner and you can apply it two ways. You can of course just go straight onto the eyelid because it is quite smooth but because I want to cover a larger surface area I'm actually just gonna warm it on my fingertip kind of covering a large area and press it down and this also gives a softer look. So I did show you how you can get a lot of precision and literally create graphic liner by just going in with the pencil on the eyelid. But if you want to use it more in the capacity that I like to use these, warm it up on your finger first and use it to create a larger surface area that you can apply the eyeliner. Let's see, it's working out beautifully. And because it does apply a little bit more sheer when you do that, you can finish off by just applying directly to the eyelid to get that high shine and high chrome effect. And then just like with any shadow, after you apply the lid shade, just work on keeping it nice and cohesive looking. Blend it in. You gotta make sure you do this though before the eyeliner sets down because once it's down, it's down. But that's what makes it really great for oily eyelids. Okay, let me finish my concealer and stuff and then we'll work on the lower lash line together. I am feeling so much better with the rest of my makeup actually done. <laughs> okay, so face makeup is on. We're gonna go back into the eyeshadow palette and I'm gonna take the green shade right here on a small brush and I'm gonna blend this along the entire lower lash line. And look at how the eyeliner is doing. She is still sitting pretty. And then I'm gonna take some of Ocean right here, which is this dark blue. Get that in the outer corner to bring out the blue element. Taking my laser liner, and I'm just gonna run it along the inner half of the lower lash line. Just like that, super simple. Then let's pop it in the waterline as well. Normally in the waterline, you're going to get the darker shift, which is going to look really great. Spread with ease along the lash line. 
I'm about to pop on some lashes, but I just wanted to share because I've been using the Befalin lashes over the last couple of months. They have really great affordable lashes that you wouldn't believe for the price. I'll pay a pretty penny on lashes, but you absolutely do not need to pay a pretty penny on lashes. Like look at these. These are foaming lashes and you can get a lot of good wears on these. So I'm gonna go ahead and pop these on. Pull them off, measure them against your eye. My eye length is quite short. I normally need to trim a good amount. Make sure you don't leave them too long because otherwise it will poke your eyes. I like that these come quite long. I mean, don't get me wrong. Like I have some lashes that I like that I don't need to trim, but honestly, it's better for them to be longer because it is not any effort to trim these. I'm going to put glue on this, but I just don't want to lose it <laughs> while I'm trimming the other side. Okay, perfect. I'm going to pop on some glue on the lash line and then we'll throw these buggers on. We're gonna pop this on. <sighs> and that, ladies and gentlemen, is how I got today's look, which is pretty insane. I mean, I love this look. I think it is gorgeous. It was so fun. We used some different techniques than I'm used to. And these eyeliners, I can't believe the price for what you get. They are so silky smooth, they last forever, and they have the most beautiful look on the eyes. They're perfect to take me out of my comfort zone, but of course I can adjust the use to use them to how I personally feel comfortable. So a huge thank you again to Bethlin for sponsoring today's video. I will have the links down below to shop the palette, shop the liners, shop the lashes. Make sure you use that code MORGANMUA20 for that additional discount because these items are already such a good price to begin with, but they're selling it to you for a, an amazing, amazing price. The brand also let me know of this additional deal where if you buy three or more chameleon eyeliners, you get an additional 7% discount. And if you buy the Smoky Rose palette and Spice palette, you get an additional 5% off. And the Smoky palette is shown right here. Just as I said in the last video that I talked about Bethlin, I can't believe the quality that you get for the price. The reason and I agree to partner with Bethlin on these videos is because I really think they have phenomenal quality products and I'm really excited about trying my first ever multi-chrome gel eyeliner. I mean it went over very well. So with that being said make sure you guys like this video and subscribe to my channel and I will catch you in the next one. Oh by the way I forgot to show you these literally no transfer. And the first time I swatched these I was shocked because I showered exercised, washed my hands multiple times, and I couldn't get these off, so this is what I mean, you guys. This is a makeup remover. These aren't, they aren't going anywhere. <laughs> okay, bye guys. I'll see you in the next one.